why Duchess Meghan was standing behind Duchess Kate at Trooping the Color. When Meghan Markle made her Trooping the Color debut on Saturday, June 9, fans were thrilled to see the newest member of the royal family back from her honeymoon and standing alongside Prince Harry and the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge during the annual flypast. It was the first time she and her new husband appeared in public since their trip and Meghan looked fresh and fabulous in a pale pink dress by Carolina Herrera while Harry looked handsome in his dashing military garb. But others were quick to point out that the Duchess of Sussex was positioned behind her new sister-in-law Duchess Kate on the Buckingham Palace balcony, and they're eager to know why. She was not as prominent perhaps as some people might have expected, but there's a pecking order, Joe Little, managing editor of Majesty magazine told people about the uproar on Tuesday. There was no slight intended, but William being the older, more senior brother would go out, first, with his wife. He went on to say that she was still in a good position because she was close to the Queen. However, a representative for Kensington Palace told the publication that the Duchess of Sussex was the one who chose where to stand. They noted, it would have come from her. There's no one laying this out telling her where to stand. And there were a lot of kids who everyone would want at the front. After the ceremony, the palace took to social media to share the exciting news that the new Duke and Duchess are preparing for their first international tour. The official statement on social media read, The Duke and Duchess of Sussex will undertake an official visit to Australia, Fiji, the Kingdom Jonga, and New Zealand in autumn. Their royal highnesses have been invited to visit the realms of Australia and New Zealand by the country's respective governments. The Duke and Duchess will visit the Commonwealth countries of Fiji and Tonga at the request of the Foreign and Commonwealth Office. Their trip will coincide with the Cindy Invictus Games, October 20-27 which will mark Meghan's first time attending her husband's beloved event as an official royal. As most royal watchers remember, the Lovebirds made their public debut as a couple last year at the 2017 Invictus Games in Toronto. So, this is bound to be a moment marked with sweet nostalgia for the pair.